Hi, I'm Kevin Klein, City Councillor for Charleswood Tuxedo Westwood. Let's talk about what passed and what didn't pass at Council in September. We put forward a motion requesting that the public service track the usage of all of our ATR paths in winter. We want to track how many people use bike paths in the winter because you know we're paying upwards of one million dollars to clear these bike paths as priorities, right? So they get cleared like Portage would get cleared, Portage Avenue, or our main routes would get cleared, P1s we call them, because that's what we decided previously. The council decided that. They decided, well, uh, Brian Bowman, Mayor Bowman, and his EPC decided that uh, that was a priority. Okay, that's okay. I'm not gonna question their decision. I'm not against bike paths. What I am for is data. So when I put this forward, it wasn't to go, aha, it's to manage it. And it's to understand whether or not the investment on the infrastructure was correct. Are we spending your money properly? Is that where you want it? Now I know it will help promote the use of a, a more sustainable form of transportation. Excellent. Is it the right way to do it? Is it the most used way? Is it the most effective? In other words, sorry. So I just said, let's track it. Is it promoted enough? Maybe we don't promote it enough. Maybe we have them in the wrong spot. Uh, maybe we're going about this all wrong. But you can't manage something. I want to be very clear about this because this is the science part. This is an emotion. It's not about what I think, what I want. But you cannot manage something if you don't measure it. We've all learned that in school. Everyone's really well educated nowadays. You can read books, you can see this online. You cannot manage anything unless you measure it. You cannot make anything better unless you measure it. You have to know what's good and bad to make something better. If you want to improve something and get more people involved and more engaged, you have to be able to measure the engagement first. So we put a motion forward. This is the second time we've put it forward, asking that we simply track the usage from December 1st until the end of February. We lost. But what did pass? What did pass? Well, we passed another $2.2 million to fight more court battles. We didn't have a problem with that. We didn't have a problem with that. And will this get us more money? We don't know. We're not sure. Every counselor was on the same call I was on when another counselor, not me, asked, why aren't we doing this on contingency? And the lawyer said, <laughs> no law firm will do this on contingency because the, uh, uh, the chance of winning is less than 50-50 and uh, the risk is too high to even collect any money if you do win. I'm sorry, could you repeat that? So tracking the usage of winter bike paths in the city, that's not something that we need to be concerned with. Residents, according to uh, <laughs> Mayor Bowman and his uh, exclusive uh, EPC that represents a small portion of our city, that's not a priority. That, nobody cares about that. Nobody cares. Nobody wants to measure things. We don't need to measure things. We know. But we want to spend more and more money on uh, court battles. What's our track record on court battles? exactly what I thought. If you, have any, uh, if you have any questions, comments, leave them on social media. Send me an email, kevin at kevinkline.ca or call the office 986-5232.